Hi, this is the second part of the project projector with your own hands and if you accidentally find out this video, be sure to watch the first part, there's a link in the description. Let me remind you that we stop on a play with box and components that are temporarily scattered inside the box. Further, in the house were made additional windows for the ventilation, on one of them a fan will be installed. Later, ventilation screen will be equipped with the protective nets. Adjustable feeds allow you to fine-tune the projection on the screen. You can twist and untwist them in case to easily adjust the slope of the projector. The machinist helped me with the knobs for the sharpness adjustment and adjusting the trapezoid so now it looks much better. To connect the flash drive and remote control at the same time, I will use a standard USB hub. It must be fixed on the front panel along with a switch and the button to turn on the tablet. Then we need to work on the external appearance of the body of the projector, grinding, painting and at the end the installation of protective nets. The hub and control are fixed with a hot melt adhesive. The lead driver for additional cooling is attached to the aluminum plate. Now pay attention for a special lead for the projectors, which I install instead of the usual one. With the same power it's much smaller, for the projector is very important. Now the lens will get more light. After replacing the diet, I noticed that the matrix was overheated. To solve this problem, I had to install an additional cooling in the form of a fan for laptops. The charging of the tablet's battery will be made directly to the battery, to the battery controller, through the charge controller from the AliExpress. On this point, this is the end. Now everything looks completed. And now we can compare the image quality before and after the finalization. As you can see, the special diet has significantly increased the brightness of the image and now I'm completely satisfied with the result. I hope you enjoyed this video, see you next time.